Hello everyone, I am Wade. Today we are here with teacher CJ. Hello, my name is CJ. Nice to meet you all. So, to get us started, can you tell us what you teach here at Fun Day? Well, uh, I have been teaching here for a while and as many teachers here at Fun Day, we are quite versatile. So, right now I'm responsible for the grammar classroom but also the writing classroom. I'm becoming a lead teacher myself, so maybe later this year I'm going to organize my own classroom as well. Can you tell us a little bit about your personal English background? If I have to say, I would probably start with my privilege because I feel like compared to other students or other English learners similar to my age, I think I have been exposed to English fairly early on compared to other Taiwanese people. Okay, at what age would you say? Uh, probably at kindergarten, so oh. four to six. Fairly maybe. young. Yeah. yeah. And it's probably because of my dad, so I have to thank him that he He's a very different father, if I can say that. Thanks, so. Dad. <laughs> <laughs> right, so. Since you've experienced this from your early age, how yes, have sir. you been able to use this skill to assist other students who are on their journey but didn't start as early as you did? I've realized it's a very difficult thing for teachers to do, especially when we are facing adult students, mm. because they don't know how to regain their interest. Just like what we have talked about, my interest was cultivated fairly early on. Yes. This is our job as teachers. We are trying to make students feel interested in English again. Yeah. Right? We are trying different ways, of course. Right? Yes. So there might not be a perfect way mm -hmm. that suits every student, but at least this is what teachers who are working at Fun Day are trying to do to create something interesting, something fun. So I also personally grew up in Taiwan, going to a bilingual school. What I found was, you know, the English aspect of the Taiwanese educational system wasn't on par. Mm -hmm. What would you say perhaps is some ways that now we have the platforms like Fun Day that can maybe assist students like myself or students that are watching? Definitely. So I personally grew up in Taiwan as well. So. Right. I have a feeling that our educational system and also our provision is very qualification oriented. Right. So Ooh, that means good. that the purpose of taking English classes or mm. learning English is mainly for qualification and yeah. also for graduation. Or to mostly. pass a test. Yes, right. So mm. students don't really develop uh, interest yeah. of any sorts when they are exposed to these subjects, mm -hmm. they just feel like, oh, this is something that my teacher, my parents tell me to yeah. do. So it means you Yes, basically. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. You have to memorize everything. Yeah. Even though uh, when we are starting to learn Chinese, mm -hmm. we need to do some memorizing as well. Yes. But we also need to understand the necessity. Also, where can we find interest in learning these subjects? Otherwise, yeah. we are going to lose the passion. Yeah, you know, so or the, we're not able to communicate. The, the motivation, yeah, yes, right? Key. So mm -hmm. I feel like uh, right now, I have some adult students who are trying to regain their interest. Perhaps it's because for their work or maybe mm -hmm. for their personal goal. Mm -hmm. And there are different ways that you can try to approach English again, definitely. Yeah. Even though maybe you have left behind this subject mm -hmm. when you graduated college or something. I think that Fun Day is a very nice platform mm -hmm. for students who really want to try out different things because our online platform is diversified and okay. very versatile. Just mm -hmm. like our teachers, they are very authentic. They are allowed to create their own materials oh. because every teacher has their understanding of mm -hmm. what is good for students. If we don't do a standardized materials and we make mm -hmm. it diversified, I think this is actually a pro for most students yes. because they will have more choices and more yes. options and they can actually start from the point where they think that is the, the most suitable for them to recultivate their interest basically. Sure, so you mentioned that Fun Day has a diverse platform or material yes. rather. What are some of those materials that you refer to? We are always trying to keep up with the news, so with mm -hmm. what is going on around our life, right? Since English is a language of communication, we are not just going to learn the grammar or the sentence structure. We mm -hmm. also want to learn how can we describe, how can we use English to describe or deliver certain yeah. information around in our life. Also, one thing is that I personally appreciate this very much. That mm -hmm. is, Sunday articles never shy away from controversial and also somehow sensitive issues that perhaps will be interesting for certain students who don't find their interest in other platforms. So that makes it more relevant Definitely. also. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, that's a lot of insight. So we thank you so much for your time, <laughs> Teacher CJ. Please do stay tuned to get to know more of our teachers here at Fun Day. I am Wade. I'm CJ. I'm glad to be here. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.